Hello. So I got a request, and this video is for Mr. Larry Kuhn about how to connect your Bluetooth device from your phone to your um, electronic um, hearing protector, which in this case is the Pelter um, WorkTunes Connect. And also, I'm going to do the. Um, I don't know if that's enough light. Let me see if I can set it over here. Herbie, you're going to have to move, bud. Come over here. Come over here. Over here, hard headed dog. Get over here. Tell you we're gonna take a bath. What do you think? <laughs> what do you think? <laughs> you wanna take a bath? Alright, we're getting a bathtub. We're gonna run the water. You want a bath? I'm gonna get you a bath. Yeah, you changed your mind, didn't you? You over there now. Okay, so what I'm gonna to try to do is do my best to show you how to um, work the um uh the Bluetooth thing. First of all, you want to get your headset, pull it down and everything, have it all ready to put on your head, your earmuffs that is. Oh, I should have turned this thing around. Anyway, of course, like I said in the other video, if I hadn't said it already, golly, I got such water. When I stand up, it disappears. Um, uh, you want to have, of course, batteries in them and stuff like that, you know, this and the other. And uh, what you do, of course you put them on your ears first time I put these on with this headband on it okay so get them on nice and comfortable push the power button of course oh I had them off what Power on, battery medium, there you go. High, medium, low. Okay. I'm talking to others, not directly to you, Larry. Just for everybody else who might be interested as well. Okay, so. Go to your phone. And you find the uh, Bluetooth setting on my phone. This is a Moto um, uh, Droid 2. Droid 1, rather. And drag it down and you find the Bluetooth setting right there, right in the middle. Okay, so you push the Bluetooth button and there. It says no paired device available. And sometimes I go to settings and it's trying to pair with my desktop right now. So what I do is what you have to do now, rather, sorry, go back to it here push that there no pair of devices available so what you do is on your headset on this work tunes connect you push the button twice and it says bluetooth pairing on and on here you hit done and see, I think you go back to it. I actually go to settings. So you get a little thing spinning. And it sees that right there. It catches it right there. Work tunes connect. So what you do is you push that button, that little tab there. And it says pair with work tunes connect. connect and you check the box and let it allow, allow that. And then you push pair. And it says Bluetooth connected on your headset. So that's how you do that. So now you got your Bluetooth connected. And you just push the back button or whatever to get out of that. So now when you pull down your thing here, you go to um you'll see on there that the work tunes connect is paired up. And so Whatever you watch on your phone or your mobile device, your smartphone will play into your headset. 
okay your earmuffs and uh, say like um, if you watch a video if you listen to music things like that you'll hear it through your headset earmuffs so that's easy okay so one more to set up but anyway there's that let me move it back here um, it, yeah it shows you right there it's connected really simple all you put all you do is put your um, phone in pairing mode like I showed you push the button twice on your headset and it'll say in pairing mode and you find it on your phone you push the little GUI whatever graphic user interface thing and you check the box and you push pair it'll pair right up no big deal um, just watch it over again if you don't understand okay so now <clears throat> we're gonna pair my other headset up and what I did was I um, took them all off I went to the things on there and I forgot them you know it says forget and it'll forget the thing on there so in case you don't want them we don't put them back on there now these I put new ear cushions on 3m sent me some ear cushions new ear cushions for them so the same thing with these you put them on your head if you got any fleece in there you get your fleece straightened up for your ears <laughs> So there's a power button on this one, not that you'd likely buy it, because these cost like a hundred some hundred and fifty dollars. Power button's right here, push it, and a power cuts on. Hang on, let's see what it says here. It says power on. Then you take your finger and there's like an arrow key here and you push down if you want to get it quiet you know and now what you do is you go to your phone and you go to the Bluetooth settings just like you did before mine is still showing well actually I need to cut these off yeah let me cut these off so I can pair my other pair up so I'm gonna hold that button for a second it'll cut right off yep now they're off okay so what you do now as you go to your Bluetooth, well, let me push it back up this way. You drag your thing down here, however you do that, with yours. And go to your Bluetooth setting right there. Push that button. It comes up. You go to more settings. Down at the bottom. Push that button. That'll come up. Okay, now what I'm going to do. Yep. Uh, let's see here. I think my thing's on. Make sure here. Oh, I had a power off. <laughs> now I'm going to try to put the power back on and it should come up for available power on. Okay. So, what I'm going to do now is let's try this again here go to bluetooth settings right here like that go to more settings and it's showing my desktop availability and it's also uh, showing the wordtunes connect availability so in this case what i do is i push there's a um a bluetooth indicator right here in the middle of my ear cup here i'm up here I'm going to push that and hold it. For like five seconds. And it'll say Bluetooth pairing on. And this is what it'll do. It'll, it'll show the availability of the, um, what it should, of the, um, filter, um, Sport Tentacle 500, which is what I'm wearing now. <coughs> see here. What I have to do is just uh, go back down and pull the list down, go from that button, push this again. That's what I should have done. I should have went ahead and pushed it first and then went down to the Bluetooth. See, now it's available at the very bottom there. Filter Sport Tactical 500. So I push this and now it's available. You check the box. And pair it. This is Bluetooth connected. So I got the 
work tunes connect um, paired up and the Felder Sport Tentacle 500 paired up and they're good to go so I can listen to music on here I can listen to videos and things like that and I can, what have you and um, it's pretty neat it's, it's like headphones now you know uh, where are wireless headphones that's what it means is to be wireless that way you don't have no kind of um, cord or anything hooked up you got it remotely by Bluetooth so it's pretty neat it's a great invention you know without cords without wires it's a signal whatever it is I don't know all the tech specs on it but anyway that's how you do that and I hope that helps uh, somewhat maybe perhaps but anyway just to show you how to go back through it again and turn these off real quick um, yeah so what you do is you slip these on your ears and you push the power button to turn it on and you go down to your uh, uh, your Bluetooth there right there push it go to more settings and it, it'll drop that list down to you and you push the power button on your Bluetooth on, on your uh, WorkTunes Connect twice and it'll go into pairing mode and when you see a pop up there in the little box or whatever I showed you um, you check the box you push pair and it'll pair up your um, Bluetooth um, uh, with your headset to your phone and you're good to go and like I said you can hear your videos you can hear your music or have you without having a cord it's a great invention <laughs> alright so hopefully that helps you out and uh, now you know what to do and uh, if you don't didn't have any previous information about it or understanding hopefully hopefully you do now see you later